Hello everybody, how y'all doing? Well, it looks like California DWR has released another drone video and this one is to uh, show you that they have restarted the spillway on May 10th which was yesterday. So, let's watch the video, okay? And we'll talk about it a little bit as we go. 9 a.m. 1000 CF S. You see that they're turning it back on. And you see it coming down the hill. And you can see where they were, have been and still are doing blowing up the rock crunching the rock so they can move it and that was up there to keep that from sliding down Boy, that thing sure, that big rocket sure ain't tearing it up. I'm going, making it go around that big rock. There's a lot in this video that you're not seeing. But as you see, up and, well, you can't see it because it's too far down. Keeping us focused on the spillway itself, not the construction area. 20,000 at 9.31 a.m. Up in there is where they're doing some more explosions to get this area so it don't slide down. Fall on anybody or that's what they claim. And boy, there's a ton of water. 30 CFS at 9.37 a.m. <coughs> boy, there's a ton of water coming down. But you can see all the, all the structural stuff that they done over here. Wow. Wonderful stuff. Lots of water. Now back this up a little up too far that's about as far as we get back as you can tell in the photo we still can't see over here at the spillway if this is where they're putting in the pipe or where they're actually putting the pipe in but hey eventually I guess we'll get it but we're not getting it at its present time and up here and in this area here right in here is where they're trying to take out by blasting dirt so this doesn't have such a straight down fall in case it was to crack off and fall down into the spillway opening at this present time 
I didn't even know that they were going to open it back up that quick. They did not leave it open very, uh, leave it closed very long this time. I'm assuming because the water itself. And since the last time we checked, uh, as far as rainfall, we're still at 47.97 inches for the year. So the rainfall has not been that much lately. So most of this fill up must be from the actual snow pack that is melting at this time. The N is 15,570 and the 8 is 30,054 which is up considerably amount from previous times and they have went down uh, about a foot about a foot not quite since 2 a.m. this morning and that's the 11th so it is on its way back down again which is good Oh yeah, and by the way, I did get the video today. I have not put it up yet, but we will do so here shortly. All right, everybody. This was early in the morning, and the sun was off in the area, and you can't really see it real well. But as you see on the tree itself now this is not branches that you see right here what you see right in here is not branches that's growing off the side of the tree and let's pause it right there for a minute right here all of this that you see right here that right there is growing off of that limb that is actually mold right now it's brown in color because it's so dry here but as soon as that gets some rain on it it'll turn the prettiest bright green you ever saw or it looks real nasty ugly dirty if it's dry and it's nothing more than what I told y'all is mold and that's what it is it's really mold and if you watch through here you'll see that it's on every branch in this tree all up there on that limb all the way down all the way down this one on that one I'm doing this quick because I was in a hurry but as you can see on that big part of the tree going up is on there it's over here on this side it's all over the place in that bark area right here it is full of mold so I just wanted y'all to see it for yourself so you would understand when I tell you that mold grows about anywhere in fact it's growing on a tree and it grows about six to seven inches tall and when it's real wet it's real long and very it's actually kind of pretty it kind of looks like the tree's got grass growing on it that blows in the wind. And that's no joke. And this is our other flyover that y'all saw the night before last. I don't even know why we're even bothering with it, but figured I'd bring it to your attention just to show it to you. And just so you could see a few more things. It's only f a minute or two long. And for me to also say please subscribe to the channel make sure you hit the bell or the subscribe button then hit the gearbox that's in there and then we'll click on it and then a little box will open and it'll be a place for a check mark make sure you hit that check mark so you can get my feed to you so when I upload a video you'll be able to get the video as well so folks uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you understand what I was showing you.
Alright. Okay, folks. Sorry about the interruption. What the hell?